Hello everybody, this is Randy. I often receive a lot of questions and uh, today I'm going to answer one of the questions I receive. Um, somebody asked me that, um, what does Jesus look like? Okay, um, Jesus, the Bible does not tell us how Jesus look like, uh, like per se, it does not describe how Jesus look like. And um, the, uh, the verses where you're going to see where the ministry of Jesus was in those four Gospels, uh, we have the book of uh, Mark, Matthew, Luke, and John, um, they, they did not describe really how Jesus looked like. But we have to know that Jesus was not white with blue eyes. And we also know that Jesus was not black, as some people tend to pretend. Jesus was not also um, uh, was not black as well. He was from Middle East. Middle East, they are dark skin, you know, it's uh, a little bit darker skin. And um, we, are, we also know, the Bible says also in the book of uh, Isaiah 53, verse 2, the Bible says that he had no beauty. Um, he had no beauty, which means that Jesus was normal, you know. He was not like, uh, as people tend to pretend, somebody with uh, blue eyes uh, and with, uh, you know, <laughs> no, Jesus was not like that. Um, Jesus was just normal. He was just normal, and uh, he was just normal. Uh, he was just normal. That one thing we have to bear in mind. And um, the question of the rest of Jesus does not really matters to your salvation. Uh, you going to heaven, you accepting Christ as Jesus as your Lord and Savior. It does no. It doesn't matter because Jesus died for everybody, for every race, for every nation here on earth, for everybody who believes in Him and whoever gonna go to Him and surrender to Him. Uh, gonna be saved. Uh, the race is not very important. Uh, John's you know saying Jesus died for everybody. When we're gonna go to heaven, we're gonna be mixed. All oh, everybody, white, black, yellow, red. We're gonna all be together in heaven, rejoicing with God. Okay. Um, I'm gonna answer the second question. The second question was, uh, uh, where does aborted uh, babies uh, go to? Okay. Where does aborted baby go to? We know that babies, babies, babies are people, right? Aborted babies are people, are, are, are people, you know, they have spirit, they have spirit. So once you kill, you know, killing a baby, aborting, it's a sin, it's a killing somebody. And it's a sin which God does not tolerate. Killing innocent babies, unborn babies, it's a sin uh, against God and God does not like that at all. If you've done that, you need to repent because it has... Uh, very uh, bad consequences when you kill and abort babies. Uh, where does the, the, those aborted baby go? They go to heaven, of course. They go to heaven because they have spirit. You know, everybody. You know, everybody. Every living human being have a spirit. And once you die, the spirit gonna go to the Father or to hell. You know, to God if you you accepted Christ as your Lord and Savior, or to hell if you rejected Christ Jesus. So, which means that um, born babies have spirit. They go to heaven. There are people that they, they go to heaven. Um, uh, may God bless you. So I'm gonna be answering uh, with time some other questions because I have like a lot of questions to uh, to attend to. May the Lord God bless you.